What do you want? Don't forget me. Who are you? I just wanted to say that Elizabeth means a great deal to me. And I'm very glad that she has you in her life, especially with what she and the boys are going through right now. Oh, I'm helping her as much as she'll let me. Of course, uh, Elizabeth's first reaction is to try to do everything on her own. Mom, I can't find my PE clothes. Check the folded stack in the laundry room. What are you doing? It happened again? Jake, don't. Don't forget me? I don't want you to worry about this. No, I'm not a kid anymore. I should know when someone broke in. Someone broke in again? I, I, I don't know what happened. Hopefully the police will be able to tell us. And if they can? I'll handle it. By yourself? I will do anything to protect you and your brothers. Even if I have to do it alone. But you don't have to. Wait, no, wait, wait. Who are you calling? Hey, are you okay? Yeah. I'm so sorry. I shouldn't have left you alone last night. I don't apologize. You deserve a nice dinner with your family. Hey, you're my family, too. All of you. Thank you for calling, Jake. Thanks for coming. So tell me what happened. It was the weirdest thing. I, Laura left, and I went to go upstairs. The lights went out. I thought I saw someone. You saw who broke into our house? And I only thought I did, because the next thing I know, I was... It was morning, and I was waking up on the couch. What do you think you saw? I couldn't make out a face. But the person said, don't forget me. And then when I woke up... Don't forget me, it was painted on a, a piece of artwork on the drafting table. It was still wet. Finn, what if they don't catch this guy? Is there a way to check for fingerprints? Or trace the type of paint? Exactly. Smart boys, all right? Now that we have a lead, we need to call in reinforcements. 